Jane's videos, and I am back with another Spirit Halloween 2020 sneak peek video, and this is on the second sneak peek release today, which is Johnny Punk. Now, uh, let me say right off the bat that I'm siding with a lot of people where I'm not too big of a fan of this one, but I will say I don't think I hate it as much as other people do. This one, I got, it's so weird making this sneak peek video for me because... I've been contemplating this all day, and I can't stop thinking about it. I've been contemplating my opinions on this all day. Usually when I see a prop, I'm able to come up with a pretty solid opinion on it right away. I either like it, it's middle of the road for me, or I don't like it. It's pretty simple. But with this one, I don't know. Like, I don't even know if it's middle of the road for me. I don't know if I like it. I don't know if I don't like it. I don't know. And I can't figure it out, because one second... I'm like, this is awful, but then the next second I'm like, this has a cool concept and appearance, though, and I'm like, stuck. And here's the main reason I'm stuck on this, is because of Miserable Marie. That's right, Miserable Marie is creating a big issue for me, or one of our sneak peeks from yesterday, and I'll tell you why. I initially loved Miserable Marie, but after watching her sneak peek over and over again, I really didn't like her that much, and she's honestly one of my least favorites of the year, and I don't plan to get her anymore. I really like her concept and everything. I think she's really creepy, but I really, her animation ruins it for me. It's just really plain, and I don't like how she leans back, and you can't even see her face for half of her animation. It bothers me, and it makes me not really like her that much, and I, you guys are going to hate me for this, but this is tied. I don't know whether... I like Miserable Me Marie or Johnny Punk more, because Johnny Punk has a lot of issues, but I also, at the same time, like his concept and appearance. So it's tough for me. This is a really tough situation I've been put in by Spirit today. With the others today, I can absolutely say the other two, I adore them. I think they're two of the best props this year. But this one, I don't know. Now, I'll go. I'll talk about the pros first and then the cons. Um, pros, I really love his appearance. I think it's really cool. At first, I was like, eh, because I don't really like a prop dressing modern. But then I realized it's kind of like the Purge when you think about it. it it's a cool concept. kind of reminds me of, uh, you know, there's a lot of mischief going on on Halloween night. Um, mischief night is actually a holiday closely tied with Halloween. And uh, it, it reminds me of that. And I really like his clown mask, too. I think it's cool. Uh, he's got a really cool concept, the kid in the creepy clown mask. And I really love his appearance. I think it's really cool. At first, I didn't like it, but I've really grown to love it. But now we'll get to the cons. First off, and this is the one everyone knows about, is his voice is literally one of the worst things I've ever heard in my life. I can't imagine his voice being any different. So I prepared myself for this. Before I saw his video, I was like, oh, he's probably going to have bad phrases in a voice with a prop named Johnny Punk. What, what else are his phrases and voice going to be like? So I prepared myself. I was mentally prepared for it. So I'm not, I wasn't too disappointed about it. But it's still one of the worst voices I've ever heard in my life on a prop. I mean, come on, it's bad. Um, I don't think there's any denying that, but I think my main issue with him comes with the animation, and that is that it's hardly noticeable, and this guy is $160, which would be fine if he actually swung. He doesn't swing, he just rocks back and forth in the swing set, it's hardly noticeable. I'm really hoping that this is only the one in the video, and that when we see him in person, it'll be a lot better. Because I might actually start liking him a bit more if his animation is better. Because that is my main issue with him. Is that animation. It is hardly noticeable. He's hardly moving. His feet are touching the ground. He's supposed to be swinging. Yeah, it, it's uh, that's, that's my main issue with him, I'd say. Because for $160, I want a noticeable animation. And that is not this. However, I do not hate him. I somewhat like him in a way because of his concept and design i feel like he's honestly a good prop if his animation is more noticeable in person and if uh you turn his volume down he's a good prop if those two things are fixed now i would have preferred for him to be a static swinger if i'm being entirely honest because the main issues are the animation and voice and if he didn't have those he would be a much better prop i will not be getting him this year um, unless I see him in person, my opinion drastically changes, then I'd get him 50% off. I'd never put, pay full price for this guy. But, um, if my opinion drastically changes, that is a possibility. But as it stands right now, I will not be getting him. Uh, this is the only prop that 
This and Miserable Marie are the only two props that I'm kind of iffy about of the entire lineup so far for this year. The rest of it I love, so that's fantastic. We have an amazing lineup this year. So not liking two is not really a big issue for me. But even then, I still like those two. It's just they're not doing it for me, and they're two that I don't want to get. I still can't figure out whether I like him or Miserable Marie more because I don't hate this guy. I just have my fair share of issues with him. But I really don't hate him, and who knows, my opinion could change on him. All of our opinions could change on him when we see him in person. I feel like the video doesn't really do him justice, but uh, I don't know. We'll see what he's like in person, but he's not as bad as everyone thinks, I don't believe. But I hope you all enjoyed. Let me know what you think of Johnny Punk in the comments below. I'm pretty sure I already know what you're going to say, but I hope you all enjoyed. Keep howling at the moon, my werewolves.